Hi, this is from Groovy Entertainment. Today we got another book to read for you. Today you book is Please Pass the Bread for 1991. So let's get started. One night at dinner, Baby Ammo just couldn't behave himself. He reached over Baby Piggy plate for the bread. He chewed with mouth open. He scooped up with his with mashed potato with his fingers and stuffed them into his mouth. Nothing anyone said could make him stop. Ammo said, Baby Piggy, stop being wild. Say please pass the bread when you want the bread. Ammo said, Baby Kermit, stop acting awful. Chew with your mouth closed. Ammo said, Nanny, please don't be so impolite. Use your fork. But Ammo didn't, didn't stop. He fetched his peas into the mashed potato on the other baby plates. Mashed potato and gravy spatter everywhere. A glob of potato plopped onto Nanny's nose. Oh, Ammo sighed. Nanny, will you ever learn any manners? After dinner, Ammo went to the nursery. He took all of his dolls down from their shelves and sat them around the table. Then he sat, but then he set the table and sat down to eat with them. At first, Ammo and his friend had a very good time. This is what I call a dinner party said Mr. Henderson, the stuffed bear. Yes, said Winslow, the wind-up penguin. No one telling us what to do. We can behave any way we want, said Gina, the fashion model doll. So let's, said Officer Rick, the wooden policeman. Ammo looked at his doll nervously. Why would they act in this way? I don't want any more of those Brussels sprouts, said Mr. H Henderson. He threw his Brussels sprout at Winslow. No one throw a Brussels sprout at me and get away with it, said Winslow. He picked up his cup and spilt his milk right in Mr. Henderson's laugh. Mr. Henderson began to cry and scream. Gina stood up on the table with her shoes on and start posing. I read a motto then eat, she said. She tossed her hair back and stepped right on ammo plate. Officer Rick lifted his soup bowl to his lips. Sherp, sherp, sherp. Ah, said Officer Rick, wiping his face with the back of his hand. I just love soup. Ammo ran back and forth from one down to the other, but nothing he did made them stop. Things got wilder and noisier until Ammo couldn't stand it anymore. Screamed Ammo. The dolls all stared at Ammo. They never heard him make such a sound before. The nursery door flew open, and Nanny ran into the room. Are you all right, Ammo? said Nanny. She looked around the room. This place is a mess, she said. It looked as though your dolls had their own dinner party, and they behaved exactly as you wanted, didn't they? Ammo nodded sadly, and it wasn't very fun, was it? said Nanny. Ammo shook his head, and I bet you understand better now why manners are so important to Nanny. Ammo nodded. I'll help you clean up, said Nanny. When everything was spick and spin, Nanny asked, Would you like to come outside and play with the rest of us? Ammo nodded and started to run for the nursery doorway. Suddenly, he skid to a stop and motioned for Nanny to go first. Nanny smiled, gathered an ammo into her arms, and gave him a big kiss. Let's go out together, my polite little ammo, said Nanny. So that was Please Pass the Bread from 1991. If you like, subscribe, share, and comment. Have a groovy day with another video coming out real soon.